there everybody hello facebook friends it's phoenix rising here and i'm donna and i'm norma and today's question is thinking that there's something wrong with you do you think that there's something wrong with you do you think that you do not deserve to find love or do you think that if you change something about yourself you can find true love and we're riding down the street right now we came from an amazing lunch yeah, with it was. some new friends and I am just so absolutely ecstatic about the work that's being done by Dr. Ted Anders and Lifelift and John Moore in Family Constellations because this is what it's about is recognize, recognizing that there's something wonderfully right with you not wrong with you and Dr. Ted will tell you that therapy assumes that there's something wrong that they need society to always makes you think that there's something wrong with you if I just did this thing then I'd be okay if I just took this other class if I just had this much weight off if I just did whatever the deal is we are being challenged by society to be something that we're not naturally and here's the thing I want you to know is that there's something wonderfully right with each and every one of you you don't have to be just like the person that society deems to be perfect or just like the smart kid in school because you have your own unique qualities and abilities that's better than that person or better than that so we all are different and yes. equally as perfect absolutely so here's the thing I want to let you know if you're feeling like you're being beaten up by your situation your circumstance your family your friends whomever is telling you that there's something wrong with you stop it stop it right now there's nothing wrong with you I'm here to tell you you just have to wake up to who you really are and in order to do that sometimes you just don't know how to get to that point we are here to help you get to that point that's what we're here to do to help you get to the point of recognizing who you really are and recognizing your absolute self-worth because that's why a lot of people are ending up finding themselves in these damaging relationships because they feel that they're damaged you, you are not damaged you have experienced things and things might have installed a couple of buttons or two into you but there's nothing wrong with who you really innately are who you came into this planet as and so we are here to help you recognize and remember who you really are and it takes some work and it takes some deep contemplation yes and really it's quite scary you guys to do by yourself and that's what coaches are here for so if you feel but the world's looking at you saying, you're fucked up. You're There's strange. Something wrong with you. You're, you're weird. strange. You're weird. You'll never amount to nothing. Whatever those, you know, that chatter is. The gremlins. The gremlins. Whatever that chatter is, whether it's outside of yourself, people telling you one thing, or you're telling yourself that you don't deserve love. Let me tell you right now that it is, there's definitely a different way to think, and we are here to help you. 555. I love my life. I love my wife. I love my life. I love my wife. Yay! <laughs> I love that. And that's uh, that's something that we do, and we'll teach you how to do that, too. It's really cool. Anyway, for now, I love each and every one of you, and I just know and hope that the world is definitely a better place because you are in it. Because you are perfect just the way you just are. Just the way you are. You ain't got to change nothing. Girl, let me just tell you. Well, you maybe that lipstick that you had on Sunday, but... Oh, please. That <laughs> lipstick was wonderful, okay? It was fabulous just the way it was. Anyway, I can't wait to hear from each and every one of you. And if you feel that you need to get to this place of clarity and that you need a, some help to do it because it's hard to do on your own, trust me, I went through it. Lots of medication. <laughs> oh, I had somebody call me, so I had to get rid of it. Lots of medication. I mean, I was on so much antidepressants, anti-anxiety, all that stuff. And I had to learn how to dig myself out of the ashes, honey, to become the phoenix that I am now. Yes. Yes. So if you want some help and you want to do it in a very quick way, as opposed to having to hash through every freaking class there is out there, and to have to do this year in and year out like I had to and she had to, then contact us. And don't forget, keep sending in the questions. Yes. All right. Deuces. Deuces. Talk to you tomorrow. Bye.